It is December 1st, so Merry Christmas. Ho, ho, ho. <laughs> Welcome to a random stitcher. My name is Lone and I'm a random stitcher. Today I am starting my calendar, Christmas Advent calendar. This is a pattern from Etsy and I'm starting today with December 1st. So it is this Christmas sock up here I'm starting. I have the pattern a chart on my pattern keeper. Um, <clears throat> I would very much like to um, kind of show you the pattern keeper as I go, but um, right now I don't have the head for it. And let me tell you why. But first, let me uh, get a. I'm starting with the first color, which is a white. <coughs> so let me get that color. I made myself a magnet. That little red cardinal. And um, this is just something I printed out on cardboard. And yeah. So let's see. 5200. Just a normal white. So how are you? Are you ready for Christmas? I was also doing some Christmas stitching. Some of you are doing this uh, this chart also. Here we are. So I have threaded. Let's go. Uh, start with number four from the bottom. Four, four in. So and it's this one up here. I think. Let me just check. Yeah, as I said, I wish you could see what I'm doing, but one, two, three, four, one, two, three, that is this one, I think. I'm just checking, yeah. It's always, you know, the first time. Just getting started. I have um, this fabric, I have uh, found the middle of it and simply uh, made squares with... Um, a water-based pen that will uh, yeah disappear when it's getting wet so okay so first stitch done and i'm going to do three of those yeah let me tell you i'm very very happy to see you here i'm so happy you joined me and i can tell you i am very very grateful for being here also because uh, i have an ac I had an accident yesterday um I actually have a, right now, a brain concussion. I think it's called brain concussion. <laughs> yeah, I think it's called concussion. So um, yesterday I was out walking with Albert and we have had a lot of snow a couple of days. So um, I had my winter boots on, everything was good. Um, Normally, I feel that um, I can they they kind of have a good grip, but I was walking, and suddenly, uh, what is this? Oh, that's a pattern. Good. Suddenly, I just um, some somehow there must have been some ice underneath the snow. Um, one second I was thinking, oh, this is slippery, I have to uh, watch out. And the next next thing was I, I, I was just flat on my back, banging my head in the ground. And um, it really was hard. It's, my, my head just slammed my back. The back of my head was just slammed on the ground. Oh, my God. It, it, it kind of gave... Um, um I don't know it, it it hurt my jaw and my back and the back of my head of course and oh man um I didn't I didn't feel uh, much else um I, I didn't feel uh, un didn't f get unconscious or something like that it was just uh I really was uh, <laughs> got a shock, and 
uh, it was like I got a hammer on my head or something. It's it's um, yeah, it hurt and not nice. I was talking with my husband on the phone, and uh, he was just uh, because I dropped the phone when I fall when I fell, and I, maybe that's why I hit the ground so hard because I was trying to uh, to <laughs> to secure my phone. I don't know unconsciously, maybe I uh, just tried to protect my phone. I don't know. Anyway, I just slammed hard hard on the ground, and um, he was finally. <coughs> I, I just took some seconds to. What the hell happened? And um, then I tried to get get up and found my phone. And uh, he was just, "What happened? What happened?" <laughs> uh, so I was really shocked. And then uh, he said, "Are you okay?" And um, and I said, "I don't know, but I think I am." So we decided that. Um, we agreed that uh, I should uh, take Albert home uh, right away and um, call the doctor if 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 there's something, if I didn't feel right in any way. So uh, everything was kind of aching, my neck, my jaw. I couldn't bite uh, my teeth together without it was hurting a lot. Um uh, but uh, I stumbled on home, and I was so scared of falling again because it was so there was so much ice, and so. But um, we got home, and um, on the way home, I started to get a little bit nausea, and um, I I called my doctor, but they were closed, and. They um, they kind of uh, gave you the number for the emergency at the hospital, but I was just I don't think it's necessary to to go to the emergency room because I was feeling okay. I wasn't losing consciousness or um, anything like that, and and the headache was not too bad. Now I felt like the nausea was um, kind of. Uh, uh, fading also, so I just stitched this wrong. So really, I um, I just thought, well, yeah, maybe it just can wait till till the next day, and let let's see how it goes. So I took some um, tablets for the headache, and um, just decided to, yeah, just. Uh, try and and take it slow and easy so I did that and then slowly it got a little better I think uh, my, my jaw didn't hurt that much and um, but I was still having headaches and I it was hard to cough because it really hurt my head very much so um, but I felt like it got better so then we decided that uh, if this uh, headache and a little bit dizzy also, if it if it was still there the next day, the next morning, I would call the doctor uh, because they would open at eight o'clock. So I woke up this morning at seven, I think, and I could feel that uh, it was still there. Every time I tried to cough, it really hurt, and. Um, so I just, yeah, maybe I should just uh, call, just to be sure that nothing is up. So I called and uh, there are four doctors there. And I um, got through with one of them. He is uh, one, of th one of the doctors I, I, really, I really like. He's, so, he's such a nice, nice man. He knows a lot about about um, uh, psychi psych psychiatric mental illness, and I explained what happened, and um, he said, um, "Yeah, you for sure 
have a concussion. It's it's a light concussion. He could say from what I have been telling him, and um, but I have to um, yeah look after myself, take it easy, and don't watch too much uh, on your phone and computer and stuff because that can really make the headache worse and prolong it so um yeah and i he said that i should i should not be afraid that something worse was was up um of course i should be um, think about it and and notice if something change but i um, it is very rare that something else could happen so because i was immediately afraid that i could have some yeah i don't know something something more serious than that so so i have just been taking it easy and um, i struggle a little bit with light and so i don't think i will stitch long today because um, i have um, my ring light on just so you can see anything because it's dark in Denmark. Um, but, and that ring light is really hurting my eyes. And, and the doctor said it was normal. So sensitive to light was normal. And um, I do take um, pills for the headache uh, three times a day. The doctor said it was okay to do that. And the, he wouldn't... You wouldn't think that it would uh, the pain would last more than yeah a couple of uh, of days maybe a week um, yeah because it was a light concussion I was lucky could have gone worse and that's why I feel grateful because who knows what could have happened I really banged my head it was really really hard I felt like it was hard and I my uh, I think the reason why I have uh, sore jaw is because I think my teeth clank clamp together some somehow and also the the punch was just hard so all the muscle in my neck and um, yeah the shoulders head everything is just tightened my husband got me a massage yesterday evening and it really helped her to the, took a hot shower also helped also to loosen up a little bit but um, yeah it's not good it's not good and Albert was <laughs> he wasn't on a leash when it happened because um, the path we were walking was um, yeah it was uh, it wasn't the place there was many people coming so um, I need my sister just a minute so here it is. I got my sister. Yeah. So and he was just running. Even though I lay down on the on the ground and normally he's very sensitive to me and how I'm feeling, but he was absolutely not sensitive. <laughs> he was just I don't care, mom. <laughs> I'm just playing with a stick. <laughs> so he was at he was at no help whatsoever. <laughs> But okay, I got up and I was got home with him, and so yeah, that's it. <laughs> that's a very scary, 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 scary man. I uh, I was on the on, uh, I was scared the whole day, really scared that uh, I was afraid that something more serious would happen. But um, yeah, luckily. It seems that it's okay, so so I'm changing to another color here. I'm changing to 3756. This is the top of the sock. So uh, in this, um, I have been thinking about because there's kind of a frame with every those small images and also the number, the date. I think I'm only doing the the little picture 
and then in the end I will finish off with doing the frame, the borders and and uh, numbers. Maybe if I feel like I have the time uh, during December I will do framing and st stuff but for now I'm just no I'm just um, doing the picture itself. So let's see. It's really odd because the, um, it's uh, my pattern keeper when I mark up a color, a, a stitch, it makes it the same color as um, uh, as it is in, in, in real. So it's white, the color, <laughs> the zippers are white, the fears are, are white, and the background uh, in the chart are also white. So they just disappeared. <laughs> I can't see them, so it's odd. Let's see. It's here. I hope you can see something because I have actually forgot to check. I think, did I bang it before? I don't know. So next week there will be an update uh, video about um, what I have been doing in November. Today I have started a new calendar. Cross stitch. Um, yeah, what can I uh, cross stitch? Um, Tracker, maybe you can say how much uh, I am, uh, which I'm working on during the month, how many days and stuff. So I finished, of course, November yesterday and uh, started a new one today. I have how many? Do I have one, one, two, three, four, six projects on it for December. So. It's hard because they're so alike, those two colors. I, I can't see the difference. I don't know if you can. I can't, for sure. It's get better when we come down to the red instead of this white. Okay, I'm just marking those up. So I have two down here. What did I do? Yeah, so I forgot to do this last half. Oh. Just as we do this, let's see. We are here. So, how many of you are doing this? I must admit, I'm a little bit shaking up uh, after my, my fall. I, I can feel it's... Um, yeah. It was a shocking experience. I have never tried falling like that. Never. I have fallen, of course. But I've never fallen and, and hitting my head like that. I have always been um, been able to um, to kind of grab my take my hand and and um, that way protect my head. So maybe I hurt my my hand, but um, I would rather hurt my hand than my head. It was so scary just lying there on the ground. You have really really banged your head in the ground. <laughs> That was not 
particularly a nice experience. So, so now we're going up here and finish those stitches. So I'm a little bit shaking up, I must admit. But um, that's okay. I told my daughter what happened and she was very concerned. And uh, they uh, have planned their coming tomorrow for some Christmas uh, fun. <laughs> so, so she asked if um, if they still could come. I said, of course. I can't wait to see my grandchildren. And they are so looking forward to it, so... <laughs> My doctor... Um, he's not the one I usually have. My, uh, my, my doctor was just not um, available on phone, so I talked with this guy, but... Uh, he was informed that I have just gotten that early retirement, and uh, he saw in the in the chat oh, apparently that it was from today. Officially, it's from today. So he said, "Congratulations!" <laughs> it was so nice of him. So where am I here? One, two, three. Oh man, this is just. I did those. No, I need one more down here. It's not easy when you can't see the white ones that completely disappeared in that yard. Okay, so here I am. Okay. So yeah, it's from today. I said to my friend, yeah. I'm a pensioner from today, and I'm celebrating it uh, with a brain concussion. <laughs> yeah. It's going to be pretty, this, I'm sure. see it. I've made so many holes now. I think it's this one. No. It's okay, I think. Okay. Good, good. So we're there. We need it. One, two, three. So we need this one also. I think I'm going to cut that so don't get it tangled in. Good. So let's see. I actually think I need this one, two, three. Yeah. Yesterday I got a new tea. It has become my favorite tea. I'm not a tea drinker. Uh, talk about it yesterday, I think. I love my coffee. I really do. But I have to start drinking some tea. Uh, herb, herb, 
uh, tea uh, in the evening instead of coffee. So I went to the tea shop. I just need to see if this is right. So this, and this, this. So we have two there, one there. Yeah, I think we're good. Two there, two there. One, two, three, four, five. Two there. I actually have three, I don't know why. No, yeah, I do know why. Okay, good. I think that's it. So, so I went to the... Um, I'm just going down here. T-shop. And uh, I found... Because I like licorice, I like peppermint, and I like uh, ginger, and I I found a tea that had all that, <laughs> and it's called Dragon Mint. <laughs> I just love it. It tastes so good. It's like licorice, but it's like there's mint also, and you can taste the ginger, and there's chili chili i don't think i can taste the chili but it's just it makes it so full it's like a very full tea that's really yeah i love it can't explain it but it really tastes like a lot <laughs> so great okay so we have uh, some small stitches only four stitches it seems with the green one 33 47 so let's find that. Thirty-three, forty-seven. Maybe it's this one. Yeah, it's this one. Beautiful. Only four stitches here, so I don't know if I can pack it. I don't think I can. There is uh, in total. 294 so yeah christmas image bound to be a lot of green so i got that tea and i had uh, two cups of it uh, last night and it is a really really a nice tea i love it i i don't think it has any yeah like I sleep better with it necessarily, but uh, I think in time it will be okay. Um, yeah. Felt like I could easily fall asleep yesterday, so that's good. Now I need where to have that. I need to count. One, two, three, and four up. One, two, three, and one, two, three, four. Is it number four? Yeah. So it's here. Yep. It is here. Did I do something? Crazy here. Yeah. Don't know. Mm. Oh, I think it's okay. Good. It is a little green leaf up here that I'm stitching now. If I can find the hole. Oh, I think my eyes kind of gotten used to the light now. It doesn't hurt my eyes now. Great. So that was those two. Excuse me. So number two here is also green. Uh, 
I am um, <coughs> have started to. Sometimes I have designed some uh, some charts. Uh, I have designed I think four. That's all Camino related. You know the hike Camino. There's the shell and arrow and stuff. Um, I have it on an Etsy profile. <coughs> <coughs> so I decided that I would. Um, oops. That I'm also also want to uh, design another one. Let's see if I can get maybe down there. Yeah, I just take it here. Yeah. So uh, the the project I have in mind is a temperature project cross stitch, where you um, uh, stitch a, 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 a stitch every day in that color that represent um, the temperature where you are. Dark green, so three forty-five. So I have some. I have it assigned in mind. So I think I'm going to try that. Could be fun. So three forty-five. Here it is. It's a dark green. So I'm working on that. It's going to be rather big. But it's a partial, so let's see. I'm not selling very much, <laughs> and it's just for fun. It's uh, like this. It's just something I do for fun. It's not nothing. I I have any plans of making money on. Um, not at all. Not at all. Not at all. So and the Etsy ones. Um, my charts is only PDF files, so it's not. Uh, I don't have to do shipping and stuff. It 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 kind of runs automatically. Whenever they somebody buys it, they just the system just sent the email uh, an email with the chart and yeah. And my patterns are very cheap because I am not the best. I don't uh, see myself as, as um, you know, an expert in doing uh, patterns, charts. So I don't want to charge very much. So it's really almost free. <laughs> but it's fun. It's fun. So. Good. So now I. Stitch two stitches up here and two below the other two greens. They're going to be beautiful. I guess the, the stitch in the middle is red. That's just my guess. <laughs> I feel like I have it, had too many strands on the, the, the lighter green ones. But um, it's okay, it doesn't, as long as only those four stitches is okay. But if it seems a little bit, and when I look at it, it's just, if I had this double, then there was four. Oh, I think I would have noticed if there was four. It's okay. <laughs> Sorry for my rambling. Well, I am always rambling, so. A little bit worse today, must <laughs> maybe. <laughs> but I am enjoying this. I like to stitch in frame. I also like to stitch in hand. Uh, both has uh, something that appears to me. Um, I love the neatness when you stitch in frame. But I love how I can be comfortable. <laughs> In my couch when I stitch in hand so yeah I like I love both Okay, 
So, four more stitches of a green color. And I lost a needle. So just end that also. My little scissor. I bought a new scissor. I'm very excited about this. I love those scissors where um, uh, where it's an animal. <laughs> Crazy about those. So this one um, squirrels, and I have ordered something with a bird also. Good. So I guess we're having a red now. Yeah, six, six, six. It's the middle of that. The, the, the leaf, the flower, I don't know what it is. <laughs> a berry, maybe. Kind of a berry. Mistletoe? Is it have No, mistletoe has some white flowers, right? I don't know what it is. I think I know what it's called in Dan in Danish. I don't think I know what it's called in English. So this red six 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 is uh, we are going to use further down. So so excited for tomorrow. About tomorrow, where my two grandchildren will come. It's, uh, I feel like it's been thousand years since I saw them last but um, so I have some nope wrong and I have some present for them um I have that cat city cross stitch I have a no man get a grip woman I have found a frame for it it doesn't fit exactly but I was meant to, to do the stuff yesterday and then find a better frame, but then all this head thing happened and yeah, I just uh, just have to do what I have found. <laughs> and for my grandson, because he's not that much into cross stitch, I, I have got a pillow for him that I have I got, I think it was on Timo. He loves pillows on his bed. So I need uh, the image on the pillow is uh, three gnomes, Christmas gnomes. So it's very cute. So, hey, look at that. So let's see, we're going down here. One, two, three, one, two, three. One, two, three, one, two, three. So here, I think. Right? One, two, three. Yeah. I think that's right. So now we are starting with the, the red in the sock, in the stocking. So I hope you um, enjoyed this stitching and I just want to thank you so much for joining me today and also uh, for um, you uh, subscribers. If you haven't subscribed, I hope you will consider, but um, I just want to thank you for if you have subscribed or not. Thank you so much for being here. It really means a lot that somebody is um, watching the videos and commenting and, you know, so nice. I love it. We can talk and exchange, um, you know, information and advice and stuff. Just having a nice time. That's so nice.
So I think I will do this stitch and go back and then it's that for today because now actually both my head and my eyes are getting tired. So but it's going to be pretty, don't you think? I love the stitching. It's just so pretty when you do it in a frame, I think. So pretty. I think my husband will be home in a bit. So, okay. So, let me mark those up. And uh, let me show you. What I have got. Yeah. One percent. Fifty nine stitches. <laughs> so let me show you what I mean when but watch when I mark one of the others. The white just totally disappears because the background is also white. I made if I can I would change the background because it looks silly that you can't see the white. So but yeah, um that's it. Can I zoom in? Here it is. It's what I've been doing. Pretty, right? Yeah. I really love that. So, thank you so much for watching. And um, I hope you will have an amazing day. And uh, yeah. I will speak to you very soon because I plan on doing as much videos um, as I can. I, I have a wish that I can do it every day. Uh, at least just just a little bit of uh, every every of these uh, images, but I don't know. But let's see. So uh, yeah, take care, and um, I will speak to you in the next one. I'm going to say goodbye now. Bye-bye. Happy stitching. See you.